So, yeah, the title of this video, what is happiness? What is happiness? Um, this is a question I've been asking myself for pretty much my whole life and quite often I've looked for it in things like going to the cinema. I thought that would make me happy, but then obviously the film ended and, and then I wasn't very happy anymore. So, I don't know, I've been pretty unsuccessful so far. Um, so I thought, well, basically this weekend, um, I had the very great fortune of meeting His Holiness Dev Amrita Swami and I asked him this question, what is happiness? Well, that is the big question these days, isn't it? What's happening is that in the past 10 years, the newfound science of happiness has really come to the fore. In other words, in the Western world, scientists, psychologists, etc., they're trying to understand, is there any correlation between material affluence and happiness? Because, you know, Western societies are all about bringing in the bucks, the pounds. <laughs> so, research has conclusively shown that beyond a basic middle-class living standard, there's no correlation between an increase in wealth and an increase in happiness. So, if you want to be scientific, if you want to be intelligent, this conclusion uh, really hits at the foundation of our entire Western society. In other words, we don't need more and more affluence to be happy. Until we can actually grasp this point and wrestle with it, our life is going to be way off track. Now, it's interesting that in my speaking at universities around the world, when I present this point, to university students and their professors. Uh, they accept it. Uh, most of them have heard about it to one degree or another. But then when I ask them, all right, how many of you are prepared to live a basic middle-class standard of life? No one raises their hand. <laughs> so here we see there's a big disconnect between theory and practice. So we're getting at the root problem of Western civilization now. They don't know what is happiness because they don't know what is the self.